A man who thinks he's going to win the Olympia this year. Good reason. Third now, place last year. If he he has to bring at least the condition of William, if not better. Skin looks paper thin just from walking. I can tell. I see the veins. Yeah. Hopefully he has everything under control. What is Sean known for, DJ? S super tiny waist. He creates an evolution with his physique that is uh, very similar to Flex Wheeler back yeah. in the days. Flex Wheeler is a legend who competed yes. throughout the 90s. And his quads, he's got crazy, huge quads with very deep separations. Yeah. Again, I don't see his abs like they used to be, super tight, super small. It looks again like he's not, you know, when he's controlling it, you can see right now he's controlling it. It looks very good. He can't let it go. Hold it together. So Sean, this is... He, all these competitors have to flex every muscle at the same time. They right. can't let one go. One go, right. one go soft. Very dry lower back. The conditioning is there, isn't it? Oh yeah. If he makes sure to keep his stomach in, he just got to be good. Yeah, he, he has the smallest waist, so it, it, it can't go to the side. So if you relax, it, it goes to the front. All you got to do is just keep it together and handle your business, Sean. Look at that, beautiful. Yeah, that, that is a tiny waist, wide yeah. shoulders. He definitely yeah. broke I don't the think, I don't think his waist is anywhere over 27, 28 inches. 41-year-old Sean Roden. Think about it, 41 years old. 41. Right? You know, 20 years ago, guys retired in their early 30s. We used to have a Masters Olympia for over 40. We don't need it anymore with these guys. Jackson. 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 Last year's runner-up, Dexter another, Jackson. He's another one who's confident of winning this show today. 2008 Mr. Olympia. 47 years old. Second last year, 47 years old. Me and Dex, we go back to 98. We turned pro the same year. You know what I mean? So and he's you're still on the other there. side now. He's still out there <laughs> still fighting out with there. the best of the best. Look and at Dex. he looks great. Awesome. We already know Dex's condition, so we don't have to worry about what his condition looks like. We just got to see um, what his overall package is. And I can see he brought his legs. His legs is fuller than they were they a big. couple of years ago. You know what I mean? He's not the biggest guy, but he also creates so much of an illusion because of his condition that he doesn't have to be 250 pounds. Dex can be 225 or 230 and stand next to a guy with 260 and make him look small in certain poses. Look at the separation of his, you know, the, the, the lines and everything in his quads. The, he the knows exactly back is in. Well, when is Dexter Jackson on point? Exactly. Always, and he, always. And he knows how to display it, too, so that's his, that's his thing right there. He's got the, the, the V taper, he's got the fullness, muscle belly. He, he, he's not missing anything, is no. he? No. And that at 47, where people already start losing body parts. Some are getting their AARP cards in the mail. Some of us yeah. at 47. Dex is still doing it. Yes. On the biggest stage in the world, the Mr. Olympia. Again, he won this whole thing in 2008. He won more shows than anybody in, in the history. That's right. Winning his bodybuilders ever. Oh, now we're going to get to see the man that made me start bodybuilding. My idol is Kevin LeBron. Until right now when he walks on stage. We saw a preview of his upper body. Nobody yes. Like Nobody 52 quads years old. Right now when yes. he, walks he kept on stage. the quads in the wraps. He didn't show any, 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 yes. No picture whatsoever. 52 years old. He's going to come out now for the first time. Standing on the Olympia stage. Yes. Um, no I'm proud of him. Regardless of what he looks like. Because he's 52 to come out and look like this. For me, I can always see the legs are undersized. Regardless of what he looks like. I think it was possible to get the legs back. For me, After so many years, like you know, first I mean, to go on. Yes. Yeah. So I didn't see it's, it's not Kevin from what we remember. Right. I know it's so Kevin years, looks better than anybody else. So yes. 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 Several times. It's, yes. it's not Kevin but it's a good Kevin remember. for 52 right. years old, Kevin and I'm proud of him. Kevin's played second in this contest yes. several times. Yes. But it's a good Kevin for 52 years old, and I'm proud of him. Time. And I'm a Kevin LeRon fan. Yeah. I, I mean, a diehard Kevin LeRon fan. I said, there's no way he can, you know, because people had him winning the show. And I said, it's not possible. It doesn't matter. But looking at him right now and looking what he's done from what he looked like, yes. he looked like he hasn't trained in his life. And he comes back and, he, you know, and he's on that stage. And he's represented right now and he's being Kevin. It is kind of remarkable, isn't it? Yes. It's, uh, as you said, there is a video floating around online where he's mocking 
his old bodybuilding life. He's posing in trunks, and he looks like nothing, like he never picked up a weight. To go from that to this in a short span, unbelievable. And a 52. It's great to see him on stage. He, it's just... He is a legend. Yes. He inspired me. He inspired you. And now we want to have to see you. And now we have. Who's coming here to try to make it six wins in a row? Phil cannot be off. He has to nail it based on what we saw some yes. of these guys. Right. Phil needs to bring it. He usually does. He has five times in a row. Can he make it six? We'll see you in a minute. Skin is tight. Skin he does is look good. Thin. He looks super confident, oh, but he always looks confident. He does. He enjoys himself out there. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's a good Phil feel is right looking there. pretty good. So this is your five-time defending Mr. Olympia. Phil the Gift Heath. Yes. We'll have to see when he stands next to the other guys, when these guys start posing next to each other. That's when people try to... You know, exposed flaws and others and weaknesses. Jockey for you know. position. But so far, Phil is looking like he brought it. Well, yeah, I mean, it looks to be like he, yeah, right there, yeah. you see. He looks like he brought Hands it Hands are in, too. the glutes are in. Yes. And his back double biceps is also a crazy shot for him, you know, that's a money shot right there. Amazingly enough, early in his career, he was cri oh, criticized right for his back. Yeah, look at that. That's that. Yeah, no, and, you can't criticize Phil for no back. It's arguably the best in the world. <laughs> no, he has the best back. It is the, the best back in the world, yes. according to Dennis James. Yes. His quads are up. Yes. They definitely look bigger. I don't know if they're bigger, but they're they more they deeper. They, they create deeper more cuts. of an illusion. That's all it is. He don't have to get bigger. I don't think he went for size this year. I think he went for condition. Looks good. There you go. He knows he brought it. Going for six, trying to tie Dorian Yates for yes. third on the all-time Olympia wins list. I can't wait to see who they put in the first part. And I have a feeling...